Hello guys, today I would like to introduce you one interesting kit for Modo, which helps me in creating this. Now I'll show you how to set up this kit to your Modo. You need to open user folder, kits, and just drag and drop it into kits. Then you need to close Modo and open it again. And now in the UV section we can see that this kit was installed successfully. The next step is to add a hotkey to this kit. You need to hold, to hold control key and let's say it will be shift C in my case. Okay, okay. Uh, so let's check it. So everything works. So let's look how it works. Here I have a very simple poly model and I'll show how this kit actually works. So what we need to do. The first step is uh, to click on the seams. The next one is show them. And the next important step is we need to be in polygon selection mode to click in rapid. And now here we go. Everything was cut by the seams. Also, the material was changed and uh, we can see hard edges here which were set up by the ECV island, so it's really good for baking. But we need to adjust it a bit. For example, here we can mark seams and interrupt again. So now we can see here separate hard edges. Let's adjust it a bit more. Also, we can uh, use UV selection, it doesn't matter. And also, we can use polygon selection and just click and wrap. And now we have how the seams were set up here, which is really useful. Let's add a bit more. Mark seams and wrap. And now everything is ready for baking, everything what you need to do just to adjust it a bit with uh, default mode tools, like to relax it, to align some lines, and everything will be ready for baking. So <coughs> if by accident you mark the wrong polygon, you can unmark these edges by unmark seams. What else? So we can turn on and turn off these edges to look how it looks and switch material from the your default material to this material with set up hard edges for baking and also so we can turn on seams and uh, clear them completely and let's say we will click in wrap and now everything is like one real island. Also, you can use it uh, maybe for some cases. Marking all the seams will be can be a bit more uh, boring and so slow. So you can use uh, or maybe not use combine it with another way of UV. You need to select polygons and just click on wrap. Now we can see this unwrapped part, this big UV island with other elements, and you can do it like step by step, like unwrap, then click, <coughs> for example, on these edges, mark seams, unwrap again. Now, here we go. Also, let's look at additional settings on this kit. Set up UV seams. What we can find here? So we can find uh, seams offset because it can be different for different sizes. But uh, you need set up this value before you apply this uh, kit to your object. So it's way right how it works. The next is uh, tip with auto hard edges, so you can just turn off it if you don't need this special material. The next is the color of this material. The next uh, 
is the color of these seams. And other settings are more about unwrapping. And everything is so simple. Also, you can refine UV mapping. It can adjust your UV islands a bit and set hard edges by seams. If you, for example, exported your model from other software, and or maybe in case if you already have some UVs, you can set hard edges. Oh, not set seams by UV boundary. So that's it. So you can set seams by UV boundary and then adjust these seams and adjust your UVs and set hard edges by seams. It's just uh, a separate option. Option. So if you turn off this tip, you need, you can set hard edges by seams with using this <coughs> button. So good luck you with using this uh, kit. As for me, it's very very useful tool.